let's move on to the things, the um, items that I already had from Boots. So the first one is the Caribbean Cocktail Shimmer Powder. Um, I bought this, I think, like around six months ago, and I haven't really used it, like, really. Um, it's just like a powder that makes you shimmer. And when you go to, like, the sun, it makes you shimmer so much that people are just staring at you, like, if you're, like, weird. So I don't really like this. And I don't really, I just regret buying this. So I don't really recommend this for you guys. Only if, like, you know, you're, like, at night and then you just want to have something, you know, like, shimmery maybe this is really good but there's also some other creams like um i think the body shop has like this glamorous spray where which has like a nice pump thing and you can just spray yourself with this nice glittery and uh, it's also it also has um a smell to it so fragrance so yeah that's really good or there's also victoria's secret creams which like make you glitter also so those are way better than this so i just don't recommend this and it doesn't really yeah, it smells a bit like, you know those old lady creams? Yeah, that's why I don't like it. So it makes you smell like an old lady. So don't buy this. I just re don't recommend it. I just bought it because I thought, like, it was good and I just wanted to shimmer, but I just don't recommend it. Uh, for the next thing is the Caribbean Cocktail Martini um, Hand Lotion, which is raspberry and hibiscus. I just don't use it, and I don't... It smells good, but it also smells like old people, like, you know, elegant smell. And I just, I really like the sweet smelling stuff. So it, I'm just saying it just, it smells like a perfume, like, that is a bit elegant, not for, like, young people. Because usually young people go for the fruity smelling. So I thought it was, like, more, like, fruity because raspberry stuff. But it's good, and it moisturizes your hands very well. So in the positive side, it's just good because it gives you had moisturizing so I don't really I just I didn't use a lot because I don't like the fragrance a lot but it's good it for the for the moisturizing it's really good so so then okay so let's move on to the next product um I talked about this no, no I didn't talk about this no I didn't um I bought this at the beach it's a coconut and almond hair and body oil um it's good because when you have like dry skin or dry hair you can just put on it and just moisturize and rehydrates your skin and making it smooth and silky your hair is smooth and silky and your skin really smooth and soft um i bought this at the beach because thanks to the uh, salty water my hair got really dry so i bought this at the boots because i said maybe it's good for my hair because coconut and almond are known to be good for your hair so i tried it and i really like it, it just rehydrates your hair so after like few days my hair was like really 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 um rehydrated soft and everything so this is really good so here you can also use it for your skin there's also shampoo today i went to the boots um store and i also saw that they have shampoo and conditioner um and body oil i think yeah body oil no this is the body wait oh this is the body oil sorry uh body butter okay let me get my facts straight but anyways uh this is really good and um, since this was really good, oops, everything fell. Anyways, just let me get the things that fell. Okay, but anyways, moving on. Oops, sorry. Okay, moving on. I'm not very organized today. I'm just throwing my stuff. But moving on. Okay, so since I really like this one, I went to the Boots um, shop and I got this one, which is a coconut and almond leave and conditioner for normal and dry hair since I thought my hair is really dry and it's sort of normal, you know. So I said, I'm going to try it because I really like the first one. And I was like, a leave-in condition would be really good because it untangles hair. So w what it says, it says that with natural extracts of coconut and almond, um, Boots Ingredients Leave-In Conditioner is special formulated to moisturize and smooth, leaving hair soft and tangle-free. So I thought this was really good because in the morning my hair is really tangled. So if I just put it, maybe it could um, make it easier for me to comb my hair and also give it, moisturize it and smooth it up. And so I tried it for two days and I just don't, it just works. It just makes your hair less tangled. But around like two hours after, it still doesn't dry and then it just gooey in your hair. So I don't really recommend this product. I just bought it and it smells, okay, it smells like really good coconut. I'm just like crazy for coconut. I just love it. 
coconut. Yeah, coconut, sorry. But I just love coconut, so I just thought this really good but instead I just was really, really, really deceived with this product. So I don't really recommend it. Maybe some people would like it because it smells good, but it doesn't, when you put it, it just smells good at the bottle. When you put it on your hair, it doesn't really smell good after, so don't recommend it very much. Okay, so moving to the next product. I got tons of Boots products. I swear, I go crazy at Boots. Um, strawberry and yogurt hand and nail cream. Um, I remember I bought this one day that my hands were like really, really dry. And then I didn't use it at all. It smells good, like strawberry, but now I'm not really into strawberry. I don't like it anymore. It's too sweet. I just prefer like um, mint or um, peppermint or just mints in general or just smoother smells. Okay, you know, after all, the 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 first um, hand cream, the one that martini thing, it's, the smell is not really that bad compared to this. I just, some people may like strawberries, so I recommend this for them, but I just don't really like them anymore, so, yeah. So, um, I'm going to read what it says. With natural extract of strawberry and yogurt, Boots Ingredients nail, Hand and Nail Cream, especially formulated to resplendish, lost, moisturize, wait, what? Oh, sorry. To give, to moisturize extra dry skin, leaving it feeling softer and more supple, while nourishing nails and cut cuticles. 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 Yeah, sorry. My, my English is really bad today, but anyways. It's really good because it moisturizes a lot, but I think that the Vaseline um, hand and nail cream is better because it just it just moisturizes more in your hands and also uh, makes it, like when you're doing a manicure or pedicure, it just makes it easier. So I just rec I don't really recommend this. Okay, moving on to the next product. I bought the Nature Series Olive Oil. Um, hair mask, hair treatment mask, sorry, and it's made of 100% uh, organic olive oil, which is good because you can't find a lot of products now which has like organic, um, like organic ingredients because most of them use like chemicals and everything, and it's also paraben free because usually paraben is not really good for your hair, so I really recommend this. It's um, hair treatment mask and it works miracles in my hair, so zoom up here. It comes in a, let's see, it was wearing some, oh, it comes in a 180 ml um, box, um, container, which is basically this. It doesn't come in any other size. Um, I bought two because I really liked it, but I have only used one, so this is what I think. Okay, moving on to the next one. Vanilla body butter, well, body lotion, let's say. Um, I really like vanilla, and I, and I still like the smell because it's like sweet and also it smells like classy and elegant at the same time so I really like this and um it leaves your skin smooth conditions and also softer so this is really good I really like it and I recommend this so zoom in there so you just spray it on your body and yeah okay so I bought these which are body sprays I ran out of this because I really I just I bought this first I really like the smell, but then I, I just smelled this, and I love the smell, so I use this, like, off. I don't, I actually, why do I even keep the bottle if it's empty? But anyways, this one's really good, both of them, and it just keeps your body nice and fresh, and when you're sweating, just spray it on. The smell doesn't last, really, so that's a bit disappointing, but if you just want to smell good for, like, five minutes, just, I really recommend this. So, yeah. These two, zoom in. This is called Flirty Hope, and there's also another one which I think is Peace or something. I'm not sure. I'll check this out for you, and I'll um, maybe mention it um, somewhere. Okay, so those two. Okay, since I bought the um, the olive oil um, hair treatment mask, I thought that I should have bought I should buy the olive oil conditioner and shampoo. So I bought it for my mom's birthday, and she just ran, my mom doesn't really use conditioner, so I bought it for me, because, you know, I just like benefiting from other people's presents. That's just sort of mean, but anyways. Like, you know, for my dad's birthday, I usually get him a present that I really like, so after that, like, I could use it. Oh, that's a bit selfish in my part, but anyways. So, anyways, this is um, conditioner. My mom didn't use it, I don't really use it, because I have my other ones, which I just love. So, um, this is 100% or 
organic olive oil, so same here, it's organic, so really good um, ingredients, which is organic. And it contains seven her herb extracts to help soften and moisturize your hair, and it's also paraben-free, so I just really recommend this. It comes with a little blood and like, laser thing here, so, yeah. Um, okay, lavender massage oil. I give, this, I give this to my mom for her birthday, and she used it once, and she said that she really liked it, so, I just try doing foot massage with this and it just really relaxes you and then it's hydrating and smoothing so um, it's formulated to hydrate and soothe your skin whilst leaving it soft, moisturized and soft, smooth and moisturized. So it's really good so I don't know if you can see it but yeah. Okay and so, oh wait there's one more thing. For my mom's birthday I also got her this foot soak which is centella to stimulate and energize her feet. So um, it also tonifies her feet, if, it, if that even makes sense. So this is the Power of Plants Botanic. So it's made of like pure plants. And I'm telling you, it smells disgusting. It smells like if you put like, I don't know. I don't know what it smells like, but no chamomile. It's, okay, it smells like that, but chamomile smells way better than this. It smells like, I don't know. I'll just find what it exactly smells like, try to put it somewhere so you guys can know. So, this is what it looks like. And, yeah, I think that's all. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I have two more things. Um, so I got this um, cooling cucumber pads, which it, you, know, you put on your eyes, and it just hydrates and makes your eyes like nice and look nice and fresh if you're like really tired and stressed. So I gave this to my mom and I ended up using it because she, she doesn't really like have time to like put this, but I really like this. And once I put on her, she was like, she, I saw on her face that it really worked and she was like feeling her eyes were like better. And so I really recommend it. It's skin light, everyday natural skin, but you can also find it at Boots, so yeah. It's a, I found this at Boots, so it's not really expensive, which is pretty, you know, about like, I don't know how much. Okay, so this is a bit, I just ripped part of the label off, but this is mango and orange blossom lip butter, so it looks like this. It, I love the little pots, they're so cute. I know that they're not really hygienic, and, uh, you know, just sticking your finger in and just putting it hurts. They cause a lot of bacteria to go on your lips, but I just love the little pots. That's why I bought this, to clean my hands before I put in this, so yeah. Okay, so that's all for today. Thank you for watching. And if you have any questions or comments, um, please leave um, a comment below. Okay, bye. See you.